Hey, hi everybody. Happy to have you here with me for lesson number three. Just a brief overview of what we're going to be painting next. We're going to be painting this wonderful little uh, Hereford calf, a photograph that a client gave me. Um, what I really love about it is the light and shadow on the calf's face, and that really is what is the most important thing in the picture. Um, I'm going to be, I've sent you a 8 by 10 uh, size of it. Uh, I've cropped it with some pieces of paper so that it's the same proportion as the 1216 canvas. I've drawn a, um, with a pen, I've drawn it into four sections and I've put four uh, sections in pencil on my canvas. The canvas is toned with burnt sienna wash, it's dry. I'm going to be drawing with a burnt sienna wash also and a wonderful little stiff bristle brush. This is how I um, enlarge a photograph onto a canvas. First of all, thinking about what's most important and choosing a canvas that seems to be the right shape and size for that subject. Um, for this project, we're going to use most of the same colors that we've used in others. Uh, I'm going to introduce a couple of new blues. They'll be on your list. If you have them, great. Uh, but the idea is that if we could use an aqua or a teal uh, on the next project, that would be great. So any, in any case, I'm going to show you what I've done already is I've taken the outside edges and kind of drawn them quickly with my brush uh, to get started. But now I'm going to show you basically how I would work one quadrant. And then I'm going to release you uh, to do it yourselves. Uh, but basically, I'm looking at this section here, and I want to, I'm just going to place the ear, for example. Uh, so if I look at where the point of the ear is on this quadrant, it is about there, maybe there, okay? And I'm going to watch the angle that the uh, outline, the wonderful edge is. The middle of the ear, the, where the ear attaches to the head is about midway, so it's about here. So I'm just going to go like that. Sometimes I let my brush just sit on the canvas and I draw straight lines. That way I don't get all shaky and nervous. And kind of do the same thing here. There. So that would be about where the ear is. And then for the eye, for example, it's super important that you get the eyes in the right spot. Um, the eye is about five eighths of the way down. A little more than half and about one third the way over. So the eye is about there. And I'm just gonna place it like that. Anyway, that game, that measuring game, goes on in each of the four quadrants until I have the whole thing drawn. Then I will use a teeny bit darker uh, version of the color that I'm using and emphasize the lines that I like and the rest of them just kind of fade away. Well, that's my, that's my trick for enlarging, and I hope you all have a great success with it, and I'll see you on Saturday.